In my last video, a lot of you guys asked me how I packed for this long trip and what pieces I brought. So I'm going to give you a really quick rundown of all of the clothing, shoes, bags that I brought with me. Most of the pieces are thrifted and I also picked up some new pieces from ThreadUp before I came here. So I'll let you know which ones those are. And if you haven't tried ThreadUp yet, it is honestly the best, my most favorite way to find secondhand pieces online because you can search for exactly what you need. You can search for exact brands, exact sizes. So it makes shopping secondhand extremely efficient. And if you haven't tried it yet, you can also use my code for 20% off and free shipping on your first order. So let's begin with the t-shirts. I brought four in total, two basic white ones, one black one, and then one athletic one. Then I have two tank tops, one dressier, one that's more casual, followed by two long sleeves, which are both new pieces that I got. This first one is a merino wool turtleneck sweater from Babaton, originally retailing at $95. And the second one is this black Lululemon long sleeve active top. I love that it just looks like a regular long sleeve, but it's super soft and has these cute little, like activewear features. The estimated retail value is $80 and I got this on ThreadUp for $34. And I brought one more long sleeve as my pajama top. Moving on to the most versatile pieces in my wardrobe are button-down shirts. The first one I got a few years back on ThreadUp. It's a Uniqlo collab piece and I just love how structured and boxy the fit is. And then I have a yellow silk one which I can wear open or closed. And then before my trip, I also picked up a sweatshirt from ThreadUp. I usually only have super oversized sweaters so it's nice to have one that actually fits me. The original retail value is $35 but I got this on ThreadUp for $13. And then I have an older thread up fleece zip that I brought to hold me over for the colder months, but I'm gonna let go of this one around June. And then moving on to jackets, I have one lighter puffer, one letterman jacket, which also has a zip off hood. And together the two of them can layer into a super warm jacket for colder spring days. And then moving on to dresses. So the first two you've seen in my old capsule closet video, I love them so much. And then I also brought two slip dresses the orange one is a new addition from ThreadUp. It's a Barami silk cocktail dress with a super crazy cool print. The SA retail value is $80 and I got this on ThreadUp for $22. For the hot summer nights, I also brought this silky pajama gown, which I could maybe style as a daytime piece, I'm not sure yet. Moving on to pants, I have my trusty Dickies, a hand-me-down pair of jeans from Anya, a very comfy pair of brown sweatpants with an adjustable bottom, so it can either be more of a jogger fit or a straight leg. And then I have my two activewear bottoms, which are both from Lululemon that I got on ThreadUp. One is like a loose jogger fit that I wear around the city as well, and then the other one is just a pair of leggings that I layer underneath my pants on colder days or for sports. And then I have these linen pants for my mom that I just wear as my pajamas, but I'll probably wear out once it gets warm as well. And then we have a flowy long skirt as well as a cute little short skirt, which is great for outdoorsy activities, but also looking cute in the city. And then last but not least, I just have a pair of really loose hand-me-down shorts. So for my shoes, I have a black pair of sandals, which I I also wear as indoor shoes and then I have my pair of white canvas sneakers which I wore here with the intention to actually replace them with the new pair of running shoes I got just because they're so much more versatile. I can hike in them, go on runs. And then for my bags, I have my vintage ThreadUp Prada tote, which is perfect for the city. And it's also big enough to like fit my journal. But for actual grocery hauls, I have my giant, giant tote bag that I also sometimes just use as like a picnic blanket to sit on in the park. And when I wanna be hands-free, I have my side satchel bag. And then for my 35th piece, I have my little thrifted safari hat. And as a bonus, I really want to show you guys my new wallet because I finally found one that I really liked. It's the perfect size. I also got this on ThreadUp with an estimated retail value of $28. I got this for five and it's just the perfect size to fit my cards, cash, receipts, and also lip balm. All access in one easy compartment and small enough to fit into my pocket. So that concludes all of my pieces that I am traveling with. I also have some accessories, some rings, jewelry, a bunch of which you guys actually made. So thank you so much.
sweating so hard. It is so freaking warm now in Paris. It's almost like 30 degrees. Hello, hi. I'm so sorry. Oh yeah, yeah, we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Look at the way that it's so billowing. Good morning, my sweetie pie angels. Today, oh. Looks like a bird poop. Today we are meeting an old friend. She's from Toronto. I actually met for the first time in Paris like four years ago when I was on exchange here. And we went to get delicious, amazing falafel. And now we're gonna go and do that again. Maybe it's like a four year ritual. And Kai, I am all ready. <laughs> It's so cute! Yes! Mm. Oh man, I miss that eggplant! <laughs> oh shit! Dead end, guys. Dead end. Ice cream, like you can actually see like the strawberry seeds on it. If you also want to try ThreadUp, you can use code FEELNOTES for 30% off and free shipping. 